So in this video presentation, we're going to look at the linear super clip, the clip designed to support PVC, PVC twin and CPC cable, twin and earth cable, in order to prevent it collapsing in the event of a fire. We know under the 18th edition wiring regulations that all surface wiring systems need to be supported in order to prevent premature collapsing in the event of a fire. Let's cut now to that regulation. So then Marcus, what does BS7671 say about the requirements for prevention of premature collapsing of the wiring system? Okay Gaz, so in chapter 52 and the regulation 521.10.202 which you can see on the screen, it states that wiring systems shall be supported such that they will not be liable to premature collapse in the event of a fire. And this comes along with some different notes as well. It gives us a bit more guidance on what this regulation is talking about. So the first note, wiring systems hanging across access routes, talking about any point where you may enter or exit a building. So that's not just doors, it could be across windows, etc. Yeah, it could be, yeah, definitely. Okay. Note two, cables installed in or on steel cable containment systems, maybe cable basket, things like that. Okay. They will already meet the requirements okay. of this regulation. Because the metallic structure yeah. of the support is in place anyhow, is that it right? It is, yes, yeah. Okay. Also note three, this regulation precludes, for example, the use of non-metallic cable clips or cable ties as the sole means of support. So Marcus, we're not suggesting that every single wiring system that's now installed is going to have to have a metallic fixing, metallic saddle, metallic tie, are we? No, Gaz, definitely not. Later on in note three, it goes on to talk about the need for surface wiring systems to be supported. So are we talking about perhaps a mini trunking on a wall? Well, are we talking about maybe twin and CPC cables that are clipped to the fabric of the building on the surface? Are we suggesting they're gonna to have to have some sort of metallic fixing? Yeah, definitely. And also maybe PVC conduit drops and things like that. However, Gaz, not every single one of them supports for the surface wiring system will need to be of a metallic material. From note four, we can take that they only need to be suitably spaced on the installation itself. Thanks for clarifying that, Marcus. So we now know that it isn't every single fixing on a surface wiring system that has to be non-combustible, in other words, metallic. So Marcus, to finish this off, do BS7671 give us any guidance on the distance between these non-combustible supports? No, unfortunately it doesn't, Gary. So it's actually down to the individual to deem what they believe is suitable for that installation and what is going to actually prevent that wiring system becoming a problem in the event of let's say a fire. Okay, thank you. So we can see how important it is to support our surface wiring system in order to prevent premature collapsing. In previous video presentations, we looked at supporting mini trunkings and PVC conduits. Today, we're gonna to concentrate on supporting twin and earth cables. I've set up behind the camera a rig in order that we can support PVC cables when we're having to drill into a wooden joist using the super clip, as well as into a block wall. Let's go there next. Okay, so we've been waiting for them to arrive and we lads. So we've got the uh, Linian fire clips, okay, for twin and earth cables. We know we're gonna call it PVC, PVC, twin and CPC cables. So we've got the twin and earth clips uh, for one mil. And we're gonna show you how easy it is to fit these. We're gonna do it in wood and then I'll go over and do it into a um, block wall as well. So let's do those. We've passed them around. We've seen the construction of them. We see the sharp bits. They are sharp as well, and then when you get them around there, call those barbs, almost like barbed wire, isn't it? It goes in and grips. So. We've got to drill ourselves a six mil hole. Okay, so I'm gonna drill myself a six mil hole, approximately just there. Whoops, not on hammer, I'm not. Okay. Okay, so drill a six mil hole, take our clip, just drag it a little bit for you for the camera, okay. And this is the only the only bit that's mildly tricky because I haven't got used to it, so that's how tricky that was. You know, so as if that was tricky. So I've just wrapped it around the actual cable itself. I squeeze it up, so just be careful with your fingers, squeeze it all the way up, and then push it into the hole, like so. And that's how difficult they are to fit. Okay. So they must be useless, mustn't they? I bet they'll pull straight out. I'll be able to easily pull that out. Yeah, if that goes, if that goes, yeah, yeah. Does that look like that's gripping my nine stone weight? Yeah, that is properly held in. You can see from my arm, can you, I was pulling on that. In a minute, we'll let one or two of you pull that off camera. That's held fully in place, really good. Let's go and look at it, do it on a block wall next. 
Okay, so we're all beyond the camera. We've seen how easy it was to go into a joist, so that's fair enough. But we're going to do it into a breeze block as well. So let's see how it is on a breeze block. I've got it. I'll set it back. Oh, no, I haven't. Set it to hammer this time. And we've got a six mil uh, masonry drill bit, so just pick a hole. <laughs> Yourself another linear fire clip okay so go around the conductors I'm gonna dress it all the way down the wall just show the process again be careful with your fingers squeeze it up as tight as you can push into the hole there we go and in it goes and then we've held it in position there's only one test you need now is the Gary lean back test my feet off the ground am I nine stone no, it's down four then, okay? <laughs> and I'm leaning back on that. Incredible. Really difficult to fit that. I can see why nobody wants to fit them because of the time it takes in order to do it. Okay, we discussed it at length and we were happy with that. Look at that pulling that arm. Okay, in order that we got it to fix. We love them.